Say hi. Say hi. There's a moose. There's my doggy moose. There's my doggy moose. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. Yo, what's up? Welcome to Draw with Qua. My name is Brian Qua, aka Qua Maddox. Do my thing. Today I have an EDC video for you, and not the traditional everyday carry video of a tactical survival standpoint. It's more of an everyday carry for the artist, or what does an illustrator take with them that actually has real utility and you could use for everyday carry. So, let's do this. Okay, first up is a handkerchief. Ooh, didn't think you'd expect that one first, right? Handkerchiefs are super handy because they help you with your nose, wiping stuff, and you could fold and like, you know, wrap up your lunch in it. You know, it's a furrow shiki style. And it's also a fashion statement because if it's in your pocket and it's poking out like this, be like, ooh, you got some style. You got some old fashionedness to you. And that's why I like having a handkerchief. I think they're super handy, they're cheap, and they're stylish. This will add a little personality to you. Next up is having a lens cloth. I wear glasses and it's super frustrating when I got smudges on my lenses. So I always have this lens cloth. I wipe them up and down. I can see clearly in HD and if the camera needs a little dusting, there you go. There we go. Lens cloth. Next, I got my keys. I got my keys on me all the time. I have them on this carabiner. Loop them on my, my, my belt loop. I have roll, keychain, I also got this poop, this poop, on my key, and here is a bottle opener, bottle opener, because I drink beer, carabiner, the hook things, it's very handy, let's see, oh, oh, lens cloth, lens cloth, you can put this in your fifth pocket, that's easy, next, I have assortment of pens, uh, this is not one, let me get here, so, I have a, 0.7 millimeter mechanical pencil, self sharpening. I don't need a knife or a pencil sharpener. I always have this, and it's proved me very well. Proved me, uh, it served me very well. Got this from Daiso, dollar fifty. Comes with lead. It's pretty good. This pen right here is comes in a pack of three at the dollar store. It's a felt tip pen, just like a Micron, but it's like cheaper ink. Of course it's cheaper because it's only 33 cents. I think it's at the 0.5 millimeter width. And it's a felt tip marker, so I can do line art with it. And I can also lend it to someone, and if they lose it, I won't freak out. Because I still have two more from the last pack. Next, I have this Cold Steel Pocket Shark, which is a marker with the screw on top. Let's see. Screw on top. There is the felt tip mark, felt tip. However, this costs eight bucks, not too bad. And what I like about it, it is a blunt bludgeoning, not bludgeoning, but, but it's a blunt, blunt self-defense tool. And so you can hold it like a coupon, but yeah, yeah, yeah. And you know, get attackers off of you. But it's not really considered a weapon because really it's a marker made out of high density plastic, it's cheap, it's light, and I don't feel guilty taking this through TSA. However, some of the other pens you might run into some trouble, pens that happen to be like pointed items just like this, can get you some trouble and look intimidating, and if you lose them, they're really expensive. So this, eight bucks, not too bad. I have chapstick. With those burst bees, I just take off the the wrapper because it gets frayed in my pocket. I have a watch. I have a watch that my wife gave me. My I replaced the band. It used to be leather. Leather gets sweaty, but this happens to serve me well. This band is pretty cheap. Just got kind of Amazon for a couple bucks. It's steel. And it works. Next, I have my. My notebook, and this is in a DDC stuff sheath. Stuff sheath, and inside it is a Muji notebook, passport notebook, graph paper. Graph paper, I can do lines, and I can do line art. On the go, sketches, sketching ideas, and writing down ideas. 
This pair works well together because the sheath protects the notebook and you have a little peak of orange sticking out in the back of your jeans pocket. Uh, next I have a just iPhone 6. Here I got one, two, three clan sticker. It's in a casemate. And I have one of those tempered tempered glass screen protectors. I dropped this a lot. And no real problems with this. So I got pictures to, to capture stuff. I got notebook to capture stuff. Pens and papers to sketching. And self-defense. I've got timekeeping. I've got nose wiping and glasses wiping. And I've got my wallet too. I keep this in the front pocket. It's a bifold. But I carry a lot of stuff and I feel more secure having it on a regular wallet and not one of those minimal wallets or money clips. So this is what I carry all the time. Oh, this is Jack Spade leather too. You should smell it. Yeah. Because from my wife too. This is what I carry. Hope that helps you. Yes. All right, we're gonna draw in my notebook. Let's see. Yeah. So I just got some like notes or whatever. What's in this? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can do this. I'm gonna draw on this page. If I take my mechanical pencil. Always sharp. I'm just gonna draw whatever, just gonna draw a girl with some like sexy lips. Yeah, carve out the chin, come back up. And then we're gonna give her like some eyelids, just, like super droopy, just like, ooh, I'm so sexy. And then go like this with the highlights. Just sketching it out. And then give her like some crazy hair and then some pointy eyebrows for some attitude. She looks kind of goth and kind of scary, but you know, whatever. And then like this and this, and you gotta put the, the chin shadow and some corner stuff, and then do, 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 shade in a little bit, the, the big old lips. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then give her some eyeshadow. That's that's what's up. That's what's up. Really long eyelashes. Like that. And then some highlight, highlight. And then let's give her some like crazy elven ears. Like this. And some so she's like this night elf thing. Yeah, I think this works. Cool. Dope. All right. Then we take our pen. From the dollar store, it was just contoured lines. You know, lots of energy. Inner strokes, but really take your time too, because you're not sketching anymore. Dope, and really focus on the main lines that need to be sharp and the lines that. Yeah, she's starting to look like a man. You know, whatever. Like so, and here's her big old ears. Sweet. And fun here, here, and we are done. 
cool. He just all the time. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, you get the point. Oh, no, maybe I'll use this. I'll use the bucket shark. And there you have it. Awesome. Draw with Quah. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you got something out of it. Maybe there's something in your EDC that you didn't have before, but maybe you're gonna put into it now. Also, please like the video if you like the video. And please hit the like button if you like the video. Share it with all your friends and your mom and your pops and your grandma. If they don't know what EDC is, maybe they should know what EDC is. And please subscribe if you haven't done it already. And then please head over to my store and buy some art. Buy some art, it really helps a lot. Thank you so much. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah.